The other interesting thing about these backhands is they're pretty similar, and I'm trying to notice a, a common denominator. Watch how low this guy gets. Look at that. We'll do a serve one later. Platform serve. Everyone's jumping. Check out his left hand. Watch his left hand when he sets up for his backhand. See, it starts up the right throat. Then he drops the hand down. I kind of like that because when you do a slice, you can't tell to the last second. Because when you do a slice, it'll look like you're setting up for a slice, a one-handed slice, and then you drop the hand down. Look at that knee bend. Look how low he is. He's doing a lunge every time he hits a backhand. He must have great legs. Straight arm back, beautiful, but can't point to the ball. Now look at the follow through over the top, through the shoulder. Everyone has these massive follow throughs over top, and they're pretty much scratching their back with the racket. And I think that's because you accelerate the ball so hard with your frame, you move the head so quickly, that it's difficult to slow it down without a full extension and a full follow through. 